Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Samuel Dada and I'm a PhD student at the University of Cambridge in the Department of Chemistry. Welcome to a day in the life of a PhD student. Hope you enjoy this. Um, chill day, I've made it a chill day because this is my last week um, in a lab before Christmas holiday and also Lena's leaving today which is so sad but hopefully it should be a nice, calm, relaxing day. At the department now, Department of Chemistry, um, yeah, honestly, last week was so busy for me. Um, I feel like this week is just going to be a nice chilled out week. Um, last week I was getting in around like 9 o'clock every single day. Um, and leaving super, super late, even like some days around like 7, 7.30. But today I'm getting in probably around quarter to 10. Um, but yeah, hopefully it should be a nice chilled out day. I just feel like the last week of term, um, or for me, the last week of term, I just need to try and make it as relaxed as possible because I've been super, super stressed out. Um, but yeah, hopefully today everything works out the way it should um, and I don't get any like super nasty surprises of like things that I don't want to be doing today happening. So yeah. Let's see how today goes. Hopefully it should be a lovely nice day and also as like I said um Lena's leaving today so need to say goodbye to her properly and plan some stuff as well. But yeah, let's see how today goes. Before I wanna ban myself, I don't wanna hang around y'all. Pray for good health. One day I'm really gonna ball. Fuck around and buy the whole mall. Breaking that cake, flexing 700 in the bank. Not a superhero, I don't save. Look at my face, look at my grace. Don't match up, no love, fuck a date. I just fade. When I hit the jack, you can get the pie. Every night I got my life stop. Yeah, when I check the cost, I was like, Oh, that's expensive. I roll flex in my ear. You a fucking hot, you weird. Which way I'ma steer? Know the bags of money be near. But you don't really see it till it's here. That's all I do since I was 17. Cutting up tof. Why you lame, soft, don't speak? Fuck it, I don't know you. Yeah, get run through by my team. Dropping them hits like Blitz. I bought my cheese like Ritz. Fuck a vacay, don't trip. Y'all don't know people like this. 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 Dropping them. So basically, I've just finished. I'm doing the gels um, to check my purification. Um, from last week because I purified um, the protein last week so I'm basically running a gel for another 40 minutes but now I'm going to be doing some worm stuff um, and I'm going to check my column from last week as well so yeah it's all going well so far so hopefully my protein is pure and my gel is clean but we'll have to wait and see So I've just basically had a look at the worms. Um, I'm gonna chunk them for maintenance later after lunch. But what we need to do now is check the gels and um, if it's finished running, I'm gonna basically stain them. Um, 
for now, during lunch, and then after lunch, I'll check the bands on um, on the gel reader. Yeah, let's go. Okay, yeah, the stairs time. Look at that. All the way up. I have to go. Oh. So I've just had lunch and now I'm just basically going to check my gels to see how they look and just from first glance they look really really good I'm going to leave them a bit longer um, but yeah the one thing that is really really good is that the protein looks very very pure I can't really see any other like bands so that's always a very good sign so I'm going to take some nice images of it which is going to be great but you can see no other bands up on top is just one nice line band with all the fractions and the same here with the other fractions here but obviously you see like the ones in the middle have a very a high protein concentration which is great and that's similar here as well so this is good i've got my purified nice protein um can i just say this took almost four days of purification because you had to Di do dialysis, do um, some iron exchange, and then size exclusion in order to get this. So yeah, it's all good. So now I'm just basically gonna prepare some agarous pads um, for visualizing my worms, um, which I just prepared um, earlier today. Um, so I'm just gonna get straight down to that and then um, mount my worms onto the agarous pads and then use the microscope to see how they look and hopefully they should look fine but we'll see how it goes things left unsaid but there was no vision in my head i didn't have dreams till it came true no i didn't have dreams till i found you now i'm dreaming fast like the universe now I'm hearing songs that I never heard I'm in your galaxy Love, you set me free Even in my doubt I believe Even I'm going to be doing some microscopy on the worms that I've just prepped around here um, Yeah, using the fluorescent microscope um, It's not my favourite microscope to use, I prefer using confocal but that's what we have right now and that's what I'm going to be using um, but yeah, so far everything's going well, so hopefully this should go well and then after this I basically, I'm going to image the gel um, and then send it to my part 3 student, um, Joe because um, he's probably going to need it for his report and then I am going to check the put the fractions together check the concentrations of the protein um, and then um, flash freeze them and keep them till next year, till we use them and also I need to do some maintenance chunks of the worms today so yeah I still have quite a few things to do but I feel like everything is kind of in order at this for a moment and Lena should be arriving soon um, so we can have like a meeting to discuss everything and then say goodbye um, yeah but everything's going well so far so can't complain at the moment so yeah let's get cracking on because this microscope is ready now for me so, yeah, let's do this.
If you say so, <laughs> I'm gonna hold you on that. Okay, yeah. <laughs> bye, Lena. Bye bye. Bye bye. I'm gonna get my some work done. <laughs> I've literally spent three hours doing no work. Luckily, I don't have um, much to do today, so. Bye. Look at her. And she goes. Bye, Lena. Bye bye. Bye, 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 bye. Good luck. And there she goes. <laughs> so sad. Lena's gone. Mm -hmm. I'm so sad, but I've got so much work to do still. It's the worms. So I need to do it. I can't believe she's got it now. Um, yeah. But we're gonna stay in contact and it's all gonna be good. No. So that's all done, but now I need to clear out the worm lab, empty the bins, put the bin out. Yeah, but I can do it. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. <sighs> it's already like pretty much six o'clock. Um, and I still have one more thing to do upstairs. So yeah, let's get this cracking. <sighs> I thought it was gonna be a short day, but it turned out to be a long day, but that's how the cookie crumbles really. Um, yeah, let's get on. It's been an incredibly busy day, but I'm kind of done. I just need to kind of clear up my space and everything. Um, yeah, it's been a lot longer than I thought it would take me. Um, but yeah, I mean, at least I'm done now and it's like pretty much 10 minutes to seven o'clock. Um, but that's okay, that's how the cookie crumbles on days like these. What I always say is that when you think an experiment is going to take two hours, just add another extra hour on top of it because that's how long it's actually realistically going to take but to be fair i didn't even do that many experiments it was just like more tying up loose ends from experiments i've done previously um today um but i mean it's been a good day it's been a fairly good day it's a realistic day i mean actually a long day um but i feel like i've been having these days more often than none uh, i feel like my last video was actually a, a short day in a life but this day was like actually more of a realistic day where it's just busy, 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 busy. But it's all good in the hood. Um, but guys, I hope you enjoyed this um, video. I'm gonna end it here because I can't be bothered to keep on recording anymore. 
Hello guys, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog of a day in the life of a PhD student. Yeah, it was super, super sad to see Lena go because it's been such a pleasure and such a joy and working with such an amazing young woman. Um, I wish her all the best of um, luck and success um, in the future. I know she's going to do some great and mighty things. But guys, I hope you've enjoyed this. So if you have, please um, like, um, please subscribe to my channel. And I hope to see you guys in the next video.